American, but also very proud of my Iranian heritage and Iranian culture. And uh, as my role uh, on the Board of Trustees, the Chairman of the Farhan and Generations Committee, uh, it is our intention to make sure that we continue to preserve, celebrate, and share our beautiful culture with the generations to come. The intention of our committee will be to reach out to the younger generations, the next uh, leadership, the next generation of leadership here in Southern California, and we look forward to recruiting folks to be involved with the events that we have upcoming in the year, as well as leveraging the best in social media to reach out uh, to the communities online. So I want to encourage you all to please get involved with Fat Hand. You're only as good as those who join us. Uh, and we hope that you will continue to engage with the organization. And I uh, want to share with you uh, the importance of the volunteers that we have involved. And one of those outstanding volunteers that we have with us today is Sarah Fox. So please welcome her. She's going to talk a little bit about the importance of being a volunteer with Fat Hand. Thank you. I just wanted to share with you some reasons why I got involved with the Farhang Generations Committee. First, I love the mission of Farhang. I'm sure you'll hear it a hundred times today. However, having grown up an Iranian American in Southern California, I was raised in a household that was not religious and not political. And so when I became a young professional, if you will, it was important to me to get involved in an organization that champions those same values. Secondly, I love the people. Since 2008, I have had the good fortune of being involved or being able to attend several family events, and I have had an incredibly memorable occasion each time. From the cuisine, to the culture, to the things I learned, to the conversations I had with various people, it has been incredibly memorable, and I truly look forward to being involved in future events. Third, I believe in connecting generations. I am a young professional. I grew up in Southern California. I know that we have such a fantastic network of friends and individuals who have so much to give, and if we get together, I truly believe we'll be unstoppable. Having said that, I think we should all get together to share Franny's mission, embrace its vision, and spread the word of our rich heritage, share our culture, our food, our traditions, our art, and our history through Farhan Foundation. I'll be around all afternoon. If anyone sees me, please come welcome or introduce yourself to me, and I'd be happy to tell you more on how to get involved. Thank you. Ada to Mora.
the award reads, Fahang Lifetime Achievement Award 2012, presented to Hossein Ziaoyi in recognition of a lifetime of extraordinary contributions to the advancement of Iranian studies through scholarly research, writing, and teaching. I didn't expect to be speaking here today, so I don't have anything uh, written already, but if I may, I would like to thank Farhang Foundation for this honor. Hossein would have been very happy to be here to receive it in person. But then all of us, as uh, Dr. Scarver said, all of us um, are a part of him, are a part of his legacy. So I accept this, uh, this award on all of our, our, our behalf. Um, I want to thank Farhang Foundation for everything that they have uh, done since the beginning and their staying power and the rich legacy that they, with everybody's help here, uh, are creating, including remembering uh, scholars like Hossein and um, others uh, for what they do for all of us. I want to thank Dr. Scarberg for being here on behalf of UCLA. And thank you for Hossein. I think he would have said that he owes his achievements, perhaps first and foremost to his parents, for their love and inspiration. And uh, the end of the cycle is his students.
seven tokens starting with sin, the Persian S. Sabze, Samanu, Senjet, Sir, Sip, Somak, Serke. Oh. 